Hi, my name is Ben Trister. I'm the chairperson of the board of Purism Corporation, and I'm also the first Librem 5 phone backer. I'm going to show you the initial setup of the Librem 5 phone Aspen batch. While I do that, I'll also share a bit of the remarkable story of Purism over the years from my perspective. I haven't yet met a single person at Purism whose main motivation for doing the work is anything other than to bring privacy, and security, and freedom in the tech space to those who care about such ideals. I say this as somebody who's volunteered at Purism for a few years as chairperson of its board of directors. All the directors are volunteers and they all have truly extraordinary track records in their fields. I'm a chronic early adopter of phones. I, I owned the first iPhone that had only a few apps, all made by Apple. It crashed constantly and was barely usable when it was released. The same is true for my early BlackBerry Storm, my Palm phone, my Gemini phone, and my Black phone. The Librem 5 is the first phone that's running the same operating system as the Librem laptops. It's crazy. Do you know that Google and Apple have spent hundreds of millions of dollars trying to create operating systems that run both on phones and computers, but they haven't been able to deliver such convergence? Purism's done so because of the extraordinary skills of its people and because of the nature of the free software community. The phone's also truly revolutionary in privacy and security. Finally, we'll have the ability to avoid all the tracking and exploitation done by Android and iOS. While there are only a handful of apps on it, I'm confident that many more apps will follow relatively quickly, as it's just a matter of configuring current apps to run on the phone size, which is much easier than creating apps from scratch. This phone has been created for the user and will be owned by the user unlike Android and iOS phones that are a means of exploiting the user and controlling the user. Purism, a social purpose corporation, and those who supported it are motivated by the desire to correct all that's wrong with big tech and how those companies impact our lives. Like all other early phones that I've owned, the Librem 5 will start out with a limited feature set. The development of a robust list of applications will come. A fair number of people might use the Librem 5 as a second device for the near future. I'll be supporting everything Purism is doing, and I hope you will too. The release of the Librem 5 is the beginning of a journey toward what mobile phones should have been all along. It has the potential, together with Librem 1 services, to restore privacy, security, and freedom in the mobile phone space. I'm particularly thrilled that I'll be able to offer my children the ability to participate in digital life without being consumed by it. I know that many other parents will feel the same way. If we support the movement of digital rights that Purism is leading, we can support the growth of applications and usability of the Librem 5 phone. For some who may mistakenly think this is a phone that will fully replace your iPhone or Android on day one, the Librem 5 might feel like a step backward, but in reality, it's a giant leap forward. Support the digital rights movement. Get this phone.